can sing to you the song I just want to say that I love you Just want to tell you, Lord, I love you more than anything. I love you, Jesus. I worship and adore you. Just want to tell you. Yes, I do. Oh, I love you. 
for making a way. Lord, I love you, yes, I do. Lord, I love you, yes, I do. Lord, I love you, yes, I do. Lord, I love you. Lord, I
You deserve highest praise. Oh, you deserve the highest praise. Deserve the highest praise. I 
gracious, your holy and righteous, your loving and gracious, your holy and righteous, your loving and gracious. Here I am, God, arms wide open. Pouring out my life, gracefully broken. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. I want to say hello and good afternoon, good evening to all of you. It has been a few days. It has been a few days. So gracious to all of you today for coming in. I want to say hello to the few of you. Ruby, good morning. Thank you for coming in. Thank you for being here, David. Put up, I had put that chat just to make sure the chat was working. And Superfood Parrot. Happy new week and new time. All because of the shift. Yes, here in the U.S., we have already jumped ahead. I believe the rest of you guys are coming on either next week or the week after. Living Water. Ah, welcome. Welcome in. I see you. I'll get to you in a minute. Let me just make sure I go through all of the comments. Christine. Judah, my friend, good morning. Good morning. We will connect definitely. It will come through. Singing songs together. SPT, Ali, good morning. Monday morning, so nice to wake up to. Thank you for this awesome anointed music. Online ministry. You're welcome, SPT. Thank you for coming through and providing little encouragement. And sometimes you put in the saw. That makes the difference. Listen, we're all in this together. There's two powerful songs today. We did More Than Anything by Lamar Campbell. And then gracefully broken with some they both had uh, some extemporaneous add-ons ad-libs um, that were not in the original recording I can take credit for a little bit of that but the rest of it is from Um, Reverend Weaver, New Hope Community Church. He, it was one time we were playing the first song um, more than anything, and he came in afterwards. He was preaching, and he started singing a line, and it's just like, oh, man, that's so good. <laughs> that's so good. So, yeah, I really... Really appreciate him. He actually preached uh, this weekend. It's good. 
why I was talking about the invitation. But anyways, getting ahead of myself, that's that's going to be in my heart song today. So, SPT, thank you for coming through again. And um, we appreciate you. Natecho, Natecho. We want to say Natecho. Everybody shout. Natecho. Nate, thank you so much for coming through. I know you were in the back working. Let's say, Lady Posh, what? 254, good morning to you. Good morning, you guys have come through supporting today. The Charles Fort Lauderdale Garden. Welcome to, that looks like, what is that? Is that papaya? The Charles Fort Lauderdale Garden. I don't know if you're still here. I don't remember. You know what? I have not been doing my thing. We're going to get some harps of harmony for all these wonderful people. I'm like, wait a minute. Something's missing. It's like it's really dry introductions. <laughs> so let's do this again. We get the harp of harmony on there. There's a lady posh. I'm gonna get one for you too, is it? All right, I will be in the bush. That teacher said she's at working, working, working. Welcome to a harmonious, harmonious new week. Listen, we coming in, we coming in. Good music, Natecho says. Um, <clears throat> Wanga lady. The Wanga Lady, so glad that you are here. And that face red heart shape does not translate into the emoji that it represents. Um, the standard emoji set. The standard emoji set comes through but the ones that are YouTube don't yet come through say for example superfood parents please share floating emojis if you're enjoying this content you see the little guy the heart the hearts and then the 100 at the end I can see those but the ones from YouTube just say, face blue, wide eyes. Right? Face blue, wide eyes. So those don't, don't they don't show that well. Blessings to host and all. Welcome, Anne Moira from Kenya, living in the king, um, I'm not sure if she's in Saudi or Arab Emirates, UAE. I forget where you are, Anne. I know Natecho is in Saudi, in the kingdom. But you may have been somewhere else. All right. The lady posh in. Yeah, see those little heart things they show. Um, that one also shows so grateful living water quilter listen y'all need to check out living water quilter and they have a channel that shows people how to do the thing, and it's fire, it's fire, doing well, doing well, Wanga Lady is on, Anwara Natecho, 
I'm back, my app closed suddenly, so you may have to sing a little of what I missed. Will you please? I don't remember where you left off. So I'm not sure how much we need to sing. We'll sing something at the end. Okay, 6.40. Then it's back to the bush held up. Uh, right. That's for you, superfood parents. Laquita. Mm. <laughs> All right, so, and... Okay. Dubai, UAE. Oh, back home in Kenya. All right, Asante San. Asante, Asante, Asante. All these names you are seeing are people who are instrumental in. They said, David, we will help carry the water for you. We will help you carry the water. That uh, that was good. So back home now in Kenya, Anwara said he was in Dubai and the United Emirate in Dubai, UAE. Dubai is part of the the Emirates. Oh, he was in Dubai, United. Arab Emirates. It's kind of like United States. They have different. The Emir, the guy who, the sheikh, who takes care of that state. When all these states got together and said, let's make a country. All right, so we will talk about it. My heart song today. is really simple. And um, I was really blessed to catch one of my favorite YouTubers. His name is... Um, I know his name. I do know his name. Irving Fryer. Irving Fryer was a um, a wide receiver in the NFL, the National Foot Football League. It probably could be called Handball League, right? But Call it football because the first play of the game is someone kicking this ball down the field. And Dr. Fryer has a podcast live stream called The Fryer Place where the conversations are fire. He's talking about it. And he had this line that he says, you don't know you can't see until you can see. You don't know you can't see until you can see. Let me say that again. You don't know you can't see until you can see. He tells a story of um, when his oldest daughter was growing up, might have been around 10, 11 years old. Um, by this time, he had settled in New Jersey, I believe, and was taking her to an appointment. All right, Curvy Kai, welcome. Thank you so much for coming through today. And as he was driving, you know, he was going along, and his daughter says to him, 
Dad, are you okay? And he says, yeah, I'm fine. And, you know, he kept driving, and then she says, Dad, are you okay? He says, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. He said, Dad, can you see? He's like, yeah, yeah, I can see. Yeah, I can see, but you're quiet because you're squinting. You know, this time he's always had 20-20 vision and going along. And so he kept driving a little longer and then she said, Dad, here, take my glasses. And he put on her glasses and then he realized everything he could see. He didn't realize that he could not see until he could see. Yes, I have a similar story, but mine wasn't as dramatic as driving on the highway and, 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 and doing the thing because on the highway, I could I could see fine. It's like, oh, there's a cop down there. <laughs> you know, it's like, slow down. Or, all right, wait, there is a, you know, there's construction coming up. Or, you know, something like I see on the roads, fine. My vision problems happened a little less dramatic because I could see on the road, fine. My distance vision is perfect. But there was one day that I tried to read. You know, you're trying to put something up to your eyes and you realize that, oh, I cannot make out what that is. Like, You know, you start to push it farther away from, farther away from you, realize you need some reading glasses. So I, I took myself down to the, I took myself down to the eye doctor, the optometrist, I believe they're called, optician, the optometrist. And, you know, they put you through the little machine when these like, and he's, can you see what that is? Is it, it's like ah, you just need to get some reading glasses, you know, the one twenty five strength or the one fifty strength or whatever it is. I believe I was at one twenty five at that time, and it's just interesting to to realize that you can't see. Until you can. You don't realize you cannot see. Until So there are some things that for me were really eye-opening. During this pandemic, attended a bunch of online Bible studies and my eyes were really open. To the fact that God sees you differently then sometimes how we see ourselves. we A lot of times we position ourselves as I'm just a, a low down, good for nothing um, person. But God doesn't see you that way. God doesn't see you as less than. He sees you as more. And as I said, in 2024, we're looking at more. I don't know how many of you are hearing this, but you are a child of God. You're worth his coming to this earth and sharing, you know, sharing his his goodness with us 
you're worth it. As a son or a daughter, he sees you for who you are. A child of God. <clears throat> so I encourage you as you go through this day to take stock of that. See you as a child of God. All right. And that, my friends, is my heart song today. Okay, so I took a little bit of time. I was not really reading the chat, but I wanted to share that story with you today. It's it's good to be in the land of the living, to see another day. It's like you can't see what you can't see until you can. Oh, man, such a good story, such a good lesson. So pay close attention to what you can see. And know that you have what it takes to make it through. All right, so let's get back to this chat I remember seeing here. Anne is giving us some more. It's like, yes, Dubai is one of the seven emirates. Okay, that's good. That is good. She's like, uh, Laquita is like, I accept the run. Feel free to try variations. Curvy Kai was saying, driving and listening. Wanga Lady is giving the heart. Face red heart shape. I got to remember that. Face red heart shape okay okay some of these I know Abu Dhabi and Dubai those are the two ones that I know Sharjah Ajman Umal Kuwain Ras Al Kamin Kaima Rasal Kaima and Fujara. Fujaira, Fujaira. Rasal Kaima, Fujaira. Those are the states, the seven emirates in the United Arab Emirates, Abu Dhabi, Dubai. You know, there's a young man that I met last summer. Yeah, it was in the summer from the UAE. He's like, from Jamaica, came to the States, and now they're living in, in, uh, in Dubai. It's like, how do you end? It's like, hey, there's work. There's work. Good morning, Equip Institute. Good morning. I um, was going to email you, um, Florence, to, to get that um, some more context. <laughs> what you want? What you want? <clears throat> so in that... We want to say good morning. You can't, you don't know, you can't see until you can see. You don't know you can see until you can see. I believe there's no T on the first part. You don't know you can see until you can see. Relating the story of uh, the 
Dr. Irving Fryer, former NFL wide receiver. My goodness. I said, can't talk this morning. <laughs> you don't know you can see until you can see. I'm grateful for this time that we have today. Okay. No, no, no problem. No problem. No problem, uh, Florence. It's good. It was really a revelation for me. I don't know if anyone could relate to this. Some of you wear glasses. Some of you do not. But, like, looking at the camera right now, I can see it. I can see myself because the camera itself has a little pop-up thingamajig that I can see. But I'm looking at myself in, in this camera here. We're looking at the monitor that's below it. I can see. Yes, Mac, it's it's an hour earlier. We've we've gone ahead. I think I might have mentioned uh did I mention? I did not mention it on uh I did not mention it on um on Friday. Daylight savings time happens yet. The second Sunday in March. We spring forward. Second Sunday in March. I believe you guys may actually be this two weeks, either this week or the next. So, yes, the time change is happening. So I think you're going to be on at 2 (laughs) p.m. Eastern. Yes. Yes. Until you guys catch up, I think All right, it's mode. That avatar looks a lot like singing songs together SPT. Um, but thank you for coming through today. See, Quip and CD is like, hey, when did I get the wrench? Yeah, no, that happened. <laughs> that happened. And uh, there are some more people that need wrenches. I just haven't gotten around to them. <clears throat> I uh, keep forgetting. And so, because um, you're around a lot, you can help. And really, we haven't had the problems with um, with uh, trolls so much since we updated our our banned words list. See, I'll go back and watch the the replay now, taking my lunch break. Okay, so glad that you were able to just pop in, Um, Mac. So glad you were able to pop in. Just wanted to say you don't know you can see until you can see. And in this instance, talking about uh, Irving Fryer driving around his town with his daughter, didn't realize he was blind, not blind, but didn't realize that he wasn't seeing clearly until he put on a pair of spectacles, a pair of glasses, a pair of glasses that really revealed the lack 
a vision that you have. And so many of us go through life, go through our days thinking we have the tools we need to see clearly until you know someone pulls the blinders off or gives us a pair of glasses to say hey you need that's the list equip institute <laughs> that is the list yo i they used to come regularly regularly until I got Paul's list and ever since then I could do a show without a moderator unless you know there are some links that I wanted to drop like hey I need your mailing list I actually have a do I have that scene set up do I have that scene? I don't think I got that scene. This is the comments window. I think I have it there. It's just not on my stream deck for this show. Oh, I took it off. What it said? Give me your email. I have a really, really fun, fun event. Paul's list is the one. That's the list. That's, that's, is it Paul's list? Oh, that's a question mark. Paul, if you've been around Ecram, is Paul Duncan, Mr. Moderator. He has a list of of banned words that the trolls come around with you and it's a paid list so I can't just give it to you he's worked hard regulated and moderated a lot of streams he sees what these people type so if you someone has a cuss or a swear word for example they will take that word and they will use it in different ways they realize they can't type the swear word so they try to use dollar signs and different letters to try and hide what they're saying okay yeah absolutely ah uh, the paul d yes he has a list of of words that uh, just keep the trolls out. The problem with that is if someone tries to type something that is on the list, unless it's just like, hi, <laughs> that's still accepted. But yeah, it's it's cool. It's cool. So... Very, 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 very cool. Yes. Paul Duncan. So, anyway, so we're talking about being able to see clearly, taking the blinders off or getting the right tools. For example, for me in this case, it was dealing with trolls. Paul says, yeah, just use this list. It's fire. <laughs> you won't ever have the problem. The only thing is sometimes people try to type stuff that is not cool. Until you type something, I can see you. And then I add you to I add you to my approved users list. Because there is a banned users list. There's also an approved users list. So I put you there. And then you can type with no problem. Laura's secret. Welcome, 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 welcome. So glad that you are here. Hand pink waving. Okay, that's the hand pink waving. I just 
I know it's there. Um, the other thing I can do is actually pop the YouTube chat out and bring it into a widget that will allow me to go through. All right. Thanks to everyone again for who loves this with a thumbs up. And so we're grateful for all of you who have done that. Who've come in and done the thing. Really. My overlay is not overlaying. And in there, when did you sneak in here? What? We it's, And I've been putting up comments without the harp of harmony. Y'all need to. He's like, David, where the harp? Laura's secret. Welcome. Welcome. Welcome to you. And in there, he sneaked in. Yvette. Homesick Mac. Okay. I did not play the harp. And um, even the Equip Institute came in with... Yeah, I'm slacking today. Slacking today. Slacking today. Do, do we doing some more stuff. All right, let me get the, the harp of harmony. Okay. So that's good. <coughs> Just wanted to to say, oh, Miss Ruby, I'm gonna get you. That's right. I'm gonna get a double, Miss Ruby. Gonna get a double. We're grateful for you. And one thing more I'm gonna say about the story. You can't, you don't know you can see until you can see. When I, the last few weeks, the last few weeks, um, a lot of you, Laura Secret, Wanga Lady, Anwara, Natecho, Goga, made a push for me to get over a thousand subscribers the thing about being a youtuber is that you have no control of who subscribes to your channel you have no control right the people that are that make it big mr beast mkbhd in the tech space at least you know i justine um, think media, you know, they all have put in the work. And it's not that they're not putting in work. They're putting in work. But for a lot of them, they were able to ride a wave or, you know, as things came in, they were able to, to progress. And so... For me, you know, I was going to all of these streams, especially, you know, Goga and different people in the techo and say, Nipitiani, Nipitiani, Nipitiani. He's like, connect to me, connect to me, connect to me. It's almost like um, from, a, from a, a space of lack, almost begging, right? It's like, oh, come on, please. Please. And on Goga's stream, um, I believe it was Lady Mart, I forget who it was, was on. That's now she's at 10,000 subscribers. She's like, no, I'm not going to do that anymore. And I said this, I made the same proclamation to myself. And from Wednesday, 
to Friday. No, it went from you know, seven something, eight something to to over a thousand. Not because I was there. There were other people on my behalf saying, look, this is a good guy. He's my brother. Come on, let's go. All right. And I want to say thank you for that. You don't know you can see until you can see. Nate, Natecho, who's in the chat now? Probably in the bush, says in the bush, but listening, was the one who saying, David, it can be done, but you have to put in the work. Right? However, sometimes you have to you have to make a determination. I am going to do this work. I'm going to do that work. But for a lot of, sometimes you don't have the bandwidth to do all of the things. And people come alongside and give you help. And I want to say thank you. And I have started returning. I go to some places and I was like, wait. There's no channel there. Oh, man. It's okay. I'm still grateful. Still grateful. Still grateful. But sometimes you have to take the blinders off to realize that you can actually make you can actually make it. Um, talking about a, another YouTuber had to have surgery on on a, on a joint, and the physical therapy sessions after were very painful, and could not make. The, there's a range of motion you have to hit a certain number of degrees of range of motion and was disappointed that they didn't make it no I think that might be me um, Mac uh it looks like my bandwidth rolling is steady. It looks like it's steady. But, you know, it fluctuates around the line. Mac, I don't know if you've used the bandwidth stats, but... Yeah, it looks like it's 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 steady. Um, I'm checking something over here.
Yeah, I'm I'm thinking. I'm thinking that that's. That's uh That's a problem there. It could be on my end as well. Mac, it could be on my end as well. All right. Um okay. Well, I think that brings me to the end, close to the end. Grateful for all 15 million of you that are online right now. As they say 15 of you online watching right now. Um, if you came late, I encourage you to go back to the beginning and watch again. If you find a problem, let me know, said David. You need to do better. <laughs> you need to do better. And we wish you all a awesome morning and week. Okay. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. It's okay now. Okay. Yeah, so grateful for each one of you as you... Audio has been stable. Okay. That's good to know. Tamaris Mitchell, have a blessed day and week. So glad that you were able to make it through. And we pray that you have a wonderful day we'll do it again on wednesday hopefully we'll have all of these issues fixed and um you all have a blessed day now want to make sure if the audio works i I'm, I'm fine video may be choppy at times um but we're gonna have a wonderful day y'all have a blessed week we'll see you on wednesday and uh there is i i stayed on a little later because there is no morning motivation i think kirk is off this week he's on vacation with the kids they're on spring break and my son is home i'm grateful for that so he's yeah they were up late last night doing the thing and um we will do what we can have a blessed week y'all cheers blessings and salutations we'll see you on the next video or around these streets. Take care. Okay. Yes. Before we take care. I want to encourage you to. Be the reason some will smiles today. As you utilize your hands. Your heart. And your voice. To make life better for someone else. Listen. There's nothing better. Than to make someone's life better. Because then it, it makes, it's like a positive feedback loop, right? So we want to keep that going. We really do bless you. Look out for some streams. I figured out how to to collapse that list into their separate tracks. So I'm, I'm really, 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 really excited about that. We want to say bye. Take care, y'all. Ciao.